Absolutely, and actually I'm going to give it to you, Yasser, because you guys <laughs> are very good bodies and I want you to get all your questions in. Uh, I don't want you to miss any one of them. So hit Eugene with some questions. First of all, Eugenio, welcome to our studio. So nice to have you here. Hello. How are you liking St. Louis? Yeah, I, I'm very happy to be here. This is uh, my first time and uh, I'm glad uh, I made it here because uh, it's incredible uh, city, you know, and uh, it very much uh, deserve the the name that uh, it is the uh, how do you call this the chess city of the world. <laughs> yeah, nice. Well, the chess city of the world likes to invite uh, you, a chess legend, uh, to the city. I've been singing your praises and telling the people of a, a time we shared in Hyde Park in London, where you sang for me Frank Sinatra's My Way. <laughs> and, you, <laughs> and you absolutely stunned me. Uh, you're, you're a great uh, singer, uh, Eugene, as well as a great chess player. Well, I, I tried to be, <laughs> but uh, usually I use my singing so that when I uh, exercise, Usually I exercise uh, one hour in the morning and one hour in the af late in the afternoon uh, by walking. Uh, it helps me uh, uh, not minding the time walking when I'm, you know, uh, uh, singing music. Sometimes some people thought that I was kind of crazy because of this. <laughs> <laughs> but they, they didn't know that I was just singing to... <laughs> You know, to uh, yes, to pass the time. Mm -hmm. uh, yes. You need Yasser to be walking uh, next to you. I appreciated yes. it very much. And again, uh, wonderful to have you in studio. Anastasia and Christian would like to ask you also questions about your career and uh, Anastasia. Yeah, you, you played so many chess Olympiads. If we are not mistaken, it's 22 Olympiads. I mean, what a record. Uh, maybe you can remember which Olympiad was the very special for you. Which one of them you remember the most? Well, I think uh, those games I played, uh, especially against uh, the Grandmasters in 1974, when I got my uh, Grandmaster title in Nice Olympiad. And uh, of course, uh, those games, when we made our best finish uh, in... Uh, in uh, Outside of the 74 Olympia, that was in 1988, uh, in uh, Thessaloniki, Greece, wherein uh, we, I think we placed uh, seventh overall. So that was a great achievement for the Philippines. And then, of course, uh, the one, the last Olympia I played in 2016, uh, because uh, uh, I made, the, I was surprised myself of my performance and. Uh, and uh, I think I got a bronze medal on the third board, scoring nine wins, you know, and two draws. So uh, I was surprised uh, myself. That's why after that, I did not play anymore in, in future Olympias because uh, I don't think I can duplicate. <laughs> <laughs> Eugene, in your uh, induction uh, speech, you mentioned Wesley So and your relationship with him as well. And he always uh, talks highly of you. Tell us a bit about your relationship with uh, one of uh, the United States best players right now, Wesley So. Yeah, uh, we have very good relationship with... Uh, with uh, with Wesley because uh, I was very much impressed with him, you know, when he was still uh, young, and uh, I well, in some of my or in one of my interviews I said that uh, Wesley is a rare find, you know, and uh, we have to give uh, all the support he needed, and I was not wrong uh, because uh, I saw that uh, he could promote or develop his uh, chess skill on his own without uh, uh, seconds. Uh, I noticed that, that uh, on his own, uh, he is uh, able to uh, improve uh, his chess knowledge. Uh, somehow, uh, typical of Bobby Fischer. You know? <laughs> was that the biggest factor when you tried to assess his potential, the fact that he was so well-versed in working on his own and coming up with ideas on his own? 
Yeah, that's uh, 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 that's part of the consideration, you know. Uh, at a young age, I seldom see uh, young players uh, able to improve by themselves. Normally, you have somebody to assist you. So that means that on his own, uh, by studying alone, uh, he can improve himself. And <laughs> the thing is, he likes very much to study chess. You know, he loves chess very much, so very important. And you also supported uh, his move from the Philippines to the United States. You felt like this would open a lot of doors for him. Uh, do you feel the same way right now? Yes, yes, of course. Uh, uh, it, it's important that what uh, the, your heart or your mind uh, wish for you to do, then you do it, you know. Anyway, uh, among Filipinos, uh, we, we consider uh, still... Uh, uh, Wesley, uh, as our countryman, as Absolutely. a Filipino, just the same. And uh, uh, we wish him, although he is representing the United States, uh, that's good because uh, he is being well supported also here in the U.S. So uh, as much as Americans would wish him uh, success, uh, same, same also with us Filipinos. <laughs> Eugene, thank you very much for joining the show and congratulations once again on your career and your induction. Congratulations. My pleasure. Thank you very much for inviting me here. Lovely to see you, Eugene. Uh, thank you very much. Uh, in the meanwhile, we do have a drink.